Hey AI adopters, Camille here. You might have seen my post yesterday where I was geeking out about ChatGPT's web search and that Chrome extension that basically turns your address bar into a mini analyst. Seriously, instant insights, uh, actual sources, no more drowning in search results, pretty mind blowing stuff. But that's just the tip of the iceberg. Something bigger is brewing in the search world and it's shaking things up in a ways that nobody expected. Picture this, small business especially, yes, the underdogs here. They're starting to actually outrank corporate giants. The whole game is flipping on its head. You know what kills me? For years, we've been stuck in this mathematical nightmare of SEO. Counting keywords, building backlinks, basically watching the companies with the fattest wallets buy their way to the top of the search results. I've been saying this for years. It was a pay-to-play or pay to win in that case scene, okay? But AI search, it's like someone finally leveled the playing field or maybe is about to. We'll see how it plays out in the end. But let's talk about what actually matters now. These AI engines, they're not just counting words anymore. They're looking at the real stuff. For example, things like um, are people sticking around on your page? Are they actually engaging with what you're saying? Are they sharing it? You know, that's the juicy stuff right there. The things that are actually interesting to us as well. Uh, I know some of this stuff was considered before as well, but I think that now these type of soft metrics will have a little bit more of an input, uh, impact. And check this out. We've got data showing that businesses that nail their expert content are seeing 60% higher engagement rates. And that's because of the AI, okay? The AI actually gets it. It understands when someone's actually talking sense versus just stuffing keywords everywhere, okay? And here's what's blowing my mind. This shift isn't just good for rankings. It's actually making the internet better in my opinion. Like what I showed you yesterday with the Chrome extension, if you remember, instant, meaningful answers instead of pages full of fluff, okay? Uh, one example, this evening I had, I was talking to my wife and I was asking her, hey, do you remember this show? It was narrated by this one guy who I thought was Captain Kirk from the other, uh, from the old Star Trek, but actually it turned out to be another guy. So I, en I ended up, Trust me, I ended up having a conversation with ChatGPT and it figured out immediately what it, who I was talking about. And it just helped me show exactly the links to the show that I wanted. And so instead of just having search results, because I didn't really know what I was searching for, uh, it was able to guide me in the right direction and found exactly the show that I was looking for. Little tangent, I apologize, but I just try to explain how different this it, it's i call it it's the difference between a search bar and a problem solver this is where we're at so what's your move here i say it should be simple what do you know inside and out what can you explain better than anyone else that's where you win not with tricks not with hacks just solid valuable insight don't waste time trying to outsmart ai just be genuinely uh, helpful Create content that makes people go, damn, that's exactly what I needed to know. That's how it works now, at least for now. Again, we'll see if the whole uh, ad, ad internet business will take its reign again. Or, I mean, it's still up there. Maybe it'll never lose it. We'll see. But listen, there's way more detail in my full article that I posted on LinkedIn. I'll link it below. Uh, I got studies, some more resources the whole nine yards, okay? If this stuff lights up, uh, you know, your lights like a Christmas tree, spread the word. Your business friends need to hear that, okay? So if you have any questions, feel free to jump in the comments. Would love to have a conversation with you. I'm curious about your take. Have you played around with ChatGPT's web search yet? How was it to you? And if you are a business owner or you, you know, a professional, how will you change your SEO strategy based on this new type of search? Is Google dead or at least Google search? I don't know, but right now it doesn't look too good. We'll see where it goes. Take care.